Hey students, my name is Dr. Kirshner. Um, this is IPHC 334 Research and Practice, section number 7351. So if you thought you were um, somewhere else or you meant to be somewhere else, then you're probably in the wrong place. Um, you can call me Dr. K. Um, Kirshner is kind of a weird name, it's not very common. Um, so I am completely fine with you calling me Dr. K. Plus it makes me feel like super cool like Dr. Dre. Um, and so I'll, I'll take it. Uh, but I just wanted to kind of introduce myself and let you put a face with a name. Sometimes I think on these online classes it's hard to remember that I'm not a robot behind a computer screen but I'm an actual person. Um, so I tend to do these videos about once a week. Um, and I also like to post like photos of my um, three and a half year old wild child. He's always doing something that's kind of funny. So I, I try to post photos just so you can get to know me. We can get to know each other. Um, I just think it, it helps kind of us feel connected even though we're not in a classroom. Uh, this class is completely online. That means all of your assignments will be online. All the materials will be online. Um, all my announcements will come out through email or through Blackboard. So if you're not comfortable with Blackboard or you haven't used it that much, um, you better get used to it because uh, this whole course is based around it. So um, it may be worth you reaching out to some friends or somebody that has taken an online course before just to get a crash course in Blackboard. Um, this course is, is going to have some quizzes, it's going to have some discussion boards, um, and because we're not in front of each other, just remember that with the discussion boards in particular, I really want you to engage with one another. So ask each other questions, provide thoughtful feedback. Um, ideally, those discussion boards will kind of replace some of that in-class dynamic that you usually see in an in-class setting. Um, so I will be grading those, really looking for feedback and responses to your peers and not just like good job or great post. Um, the syllabus is available online. All the materials will be online. So take a look at all of those. Um, you know, I am available by email. That's the best way to get a hold of me. Uh, I do have an office on campus. I'm in the Lean Nursing Building, um, which is that beautiful building, um, one of the newer ones on campus. But I'm in Office 128. And my office hours are Tuesday and Thursday mornings from 9 to 11. Outside of that, I'm generally in my office a good bit because most of my classes are all online. Um, so the best way to kind of get a hold of me is to either pop your head in while you're on campus or shoot me an email. Um, and I respond to all email within 24 hours. So um, I try to be, uh, you know, real uh, quick in my reply so that you're not waiting around to hear from me. Um, so in terms of kind of the, the class, um, most of the assignments are either due on a Friday or a Sunday. So that's kind of an easy way to remember uh, when things are due. Um, so the, the, the quizzes are generally due on Fridays. Uh, some of the other assignments are um, are due on, on Sunday by, um, by midnight. So just be mindful of that. I think these online courses do require you to, to be pretty mindful about your time and manage your time well. Um, uh, the nice thing is if you work or if you have other responsibilities, you can do assignments early, get them submitted early, not have to worry about them. Whereas with NC classes, you have to bring them in on that day. So um, I, I am flexible in terms of I understand things come up. Um, so get a hold of me or contact me beforehand if you're going to have an issue with a deadline. Um, what I'm not flex about, flexible about is when I get an email, you know, 30 minutes before something's due. So, um, you know, I'm human. I know things happen. I have a family myself. Um, but in terms of lateness, uh, that's just not acceptable. So if you do turn in something late, it'll be 10 points per day. Um, and so just get it in on time. If you think you're going to have a problem, just contact me beforehand, before the due date, so we can work something out. Um, let's see, a, a little bit about me. I'm from Florence. I'm a Florence native, born and raised. I went to South Florence High School, Southside Middle School. Um, I went to Clemson for undergrad, and then I went to Carolina for my master's and my PhD. Um, I do not have a clinical background. I, I am not a nurse. My background is in public health. So a lot of my um, experiences and uh, my examples that I'll use um, have to do with 
um, public health and more specifically with reproductive health. I worked at a nonprofit for 10 years before coming over to Francis Marion and I did teen pregnancy prevention. So my whole focus area was sexual health and reproductive health. So if you hear me talk a lot about that or, or um, use that as an example, that's why. Um, I've been at Francis Marion since January, so I'm fairly new. Um, but I'm really excited about this class. I think it's going to be a great class. I'm looking forward to getting to know each of you. Um, and I really think that it's a it's a good class because it's really going to prepare you for better understanding how research works, what to look for, particularly those of you that want to go into a graduate program. Um, this class is going to be uh, incredibly beneficial to you because so much of graduate programs are just focused around research, either collecting research or analyzing it. Um, or being a part of a research study. So I really think this is going to be a great um, a great class. I'm looking forward to teaching it and I'm looking forward to getting to know each of you. Um, so I hope you guys have a wonderful first week. If you need anything, just shoot me an email um, and other, otherwise I will talk to you soon. See ya!